Hey guys, so it's welcome back to the Weird Side YouTube again. And yes, um, I'm not wearing a hat. How surprising. I've been wearing a hat and literally in the past like, what, like 10 videos I've been wearing a hat. I just didn't feel like wearing one and I don't want to do my hair right now because I'm lazy. I literally only put coconut oil in it. <laughs> and that's how it's staying down. It's usually just like popping up. But anyways, I have another story time for you guys. I feel like I'm literally turning into Tana Mojo. Like, I'm becoming a story time channel. So this story takes place in Florida, just like the story that I told you like two weeks ago or something like that. This one is horrible. It's so bad. Okay, so from where I live in New England down to Florida, that's like a full like 24 hour drive. And that's like without traffic. Of course, me being the responsible human I am, knowing my body, I take care of all my private business beforehand so I won't have to do that on the bus because honestly like I hate like using the bathroom in public especially around people I know like I hate that because like I don't know <laughs> I just don't like it oh and like let's take a break from the story for a second let me tell you this mini story time um I have my dad's a surgical tech in a hospital, so he brings home this like spray bottle sometimes, and it's like Febreze, except it's like wicked strong, it doesn't have a scent, it just like destroys the odor. So I'm, I walk onto the bus, I'm just like, okay, guys, I have this little spray bottle, um, it's um, biological odor disintegrator, so I just left it next to the toilet. Thank the lord, people actually use it, or else the bus would smell like crap. Yeah, so anyways, I'm on the bus, I'm chilling, I'm like, I don't want to eat too much because I don't want my body to feel like it needs to release. So I'm on the bus, just chilling, blah, 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 and then, like, I go to bed. Oh, my God. Actually, I didn't even go to bed. Like, everyone on my bus was literally half asleep, and we stopped at, like, 5 in the morning somewhere, and everyone woke up at the same time. But besides the point, we eventually get to the hotel, and I'm like, Lord, I need to use the bathroom. My bowels are, like, shifted in my body. And then this guy, like, I don't want to say his name, because this is super embarrassing. Let, let's call him Chad. Chad went into the bathroom. He bolted to the bathroom. And he uses the bathroom and to to release his extremities. All of a sudden, I hear like this problem, and I walk into the bathroom, and guess what happened? The toilet is clogged. It's clogged. I have a picture, and I would show you guys it, but like, it has his name in it. And ugh, oh my god, I didn't like. We didn't know what to do. Like, we weren't sure we should call like the lobby or should we just like chill about it i honestly forgot what happened but all i know is i didn't take a crap for the next day so in total i didn't poop for 48 hours do you know what that does to someone i was like clenching i was, <laughs> was i putting myself in danger for not pooping oh god like i felt like i was gonna explode at some point i did use the bathroom at one point our toilet got unclogged i i don't know how but it did um, I think we actually got someone to fix it. I'm I'm not sure about that. I might just be making that up. Um, so yes, I did eventually get to release myself. Um, <laughs> oh, and again, like I am such like I do I hate like pooping when other people are around. Like even my parents. Like my parents outside the door. I'm like, mom, can you leave me alone? Um. I'm trying to release waste from my body. So I would literally wake up earlier than the rest of them and like poop. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this story time. This is probably like, it's not really raunchy, but this is like nasty. This is the nastiest story time I've ever told before. But let me know if you want to hear some more stories down below in the comments. It was kind of short. Um, I have some longer ones coming up if you want me to tell those. But anyways, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. And guys, I have been doing you nows lately. Um, I'm going to link that below too if you want to follow me on there. I broadcast like every other day, probably about like twice a week or something like that. Um, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye. I don't know how to ask you if you're okay. My friends always feel the need to tell me.